Opposition leader Mia Motley says all Barbadians should be provided with the means to earn a living. Addressing a meeting at Frederick Smith Secondary School on Thursday night, she said there shouldn't be a few at the top flourishing while the others are floundering. You see the government looking to build St. Moritz Castle. The government has come and asked for $80 million as it's come to part funding. The government knows that you and I cannot get more than 1% for our savings. Before the government takes its time and create opportunities for Barbadians to invest, either in terms of buying preference shares, in which case we get a guaranteed return, whether the company makes money or not, or the opportunity to own equity, in which case you will only get money when profits are made and dividends are declared. Before they come to us, they are taking it out of the taxpayers' money. And therefore, it means there's less money to, 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 to collect garbage and buy garbage trucks, less money to do things at the hospital. And right now, we have a situation in Barbados where the average person cannot get a return on their savings because once the government took the decision last year to remove the minimum savings rate, savings, interest on savings fell from what, 2.5%? down to less than one percent. So the government can be creative and create opportunities for you rather than putting all of the eggs in one basket. The government says it has given up temporary desalination plants. Why is it not saying that the companies operating them 45 or 40 million percent of those of the ownership of those plants must be made available for agents to 